Ooh. This was our morning Shangri-La Taj Mahal set up for for the night. Um, drove up from Melbourne straight after work and ended up getting here and here being Lake Windermere, Windermere Dam. And yeah, we got here three, just after three, 20 past three I think it was. Get to the front gate and we didn't have proper coinage to get into the front gate to open the boom gate. So we were left rolling the swag out on the side of the road. <laughs> So we missed one of our nights on the camping, on the block, on the campsite, so, but oh well, we're going to pack this up and we're going to go for a quick run on the lake if we can, but time might escape us a bit, it's pretty busy, yeah, we're going to pack this up and we're going to run, we're going to, a bit of exploring to do. <laughs> That is a prime example why we used a Chartered Waters mapping card uh, for here, here in Windermere. It works awesome in my way and a few other places, but we chose this point and um, came over for a sound. And that right there tells me that the fish are spawning right on the drop off, five to six meters of water. They're schooling up. So we're gonna position the boat just off them and send our lures their way. So we're gonna, that's uh, another awesome thing when people say oh what's the good thing about spot lock exactly this holds you on the spot with little effort like don't even have to do anything all you have to do is just fish so oh, and we've got some more coming through just a bit further off the drop off have a look you got another one there two three and then back before when i did a pass on the other side you can see multiple fish i don't know there'd probably be at least eight or so fish there to another one just come through there and that's six, seven meter mark. So we're gonna give it a go. There's a point there, and just to show you guys. There it is, there's a point. I just I just marked it then when I had a few fish come past. So the fish are spawning about here. So yeah, further to the point. So we're gonna give it a go. That's the point there. Swimming off with it, dude. Cast at the point. I just... That was ace. I seen the line fucking running off. <laughs> <laughs> and I was that thinking, was brilliant. That point comes down. I seen the line just go, and it was just like crack. On. Oh, oh, what a bite, man. That was really spot lock. <laughs> right off the point. Windermere Yellow. Yeah. Yeah. 
was. How's that for a Windermere yellow? That's my first out of Windermere. Here we go, measured uh, 53. Pretty short, stocky fish. Thought he was actually a little bit bigger, so we're gonna get him back. Get him swimming. Look at that, look at how gold he is. Look at that, gold. These fish school up in big numbers, especially this time of year, so we're gonna get back at it and see if we can stick. Stick one, one more, and one for the bloke behind the camera. <laughs> you, let's go. What was that, Jordan? <laughs> Come on. There's a tree down there. Yeah. Oh, he's got your winner, is he? Nah, he's just trying to take me out. Trying to? Hit spotlock if you want. Look, oh, there he is. Good fish. Is it a cod? Oh, you've got a heap of weed or something with him. Yeah. And it's a big fish. <laughs> <laughs> and it's a big fish. Oh, wow. That's a good one. So he's taking him in the weed. Oh! He is a slob. <laughs> There's a good chance Jordan's. He's. Whoa, I don't want to say too much, but he's tickling the benchmark for Yellow Valley with this one. <laughs> wow. We're going to get him out, get a measure, give you guys a real good look at this one. <laughs> All I can say is well deserved. That one's that was well. Worth the drive. <laughs> We can go home now. <laughs> oh. oh, you. Watch it. It's 59. <laughs> oh. She just, as soon as it hit the bottom, just fucking, one, one little, one little rise and she just engulfed it. <laughs> Absolutely engulfed it. Oh, it, I thought I was snared for a little bit, but, and then she just took off. So, just wanted to take off again. Woo! Let's get another one. <laughs> Wrapping up this morning's session with a bit of a feed. <laughs> a bit of a contrast to the weather that we've had. We've had a lot of rain, little sun. Now we've got the sun slowly peeking out. Rain sort of eased up a bit, but now it's like it's still windy, so it's good. Wind's blowing on those points and marking, marking those fish on the sounder and yeah, sitting off them and casting back towards them and that seems to be getting the fish. But apparently it's been tough going, but we're finding pretty consistent results uh, and pretty good fish too. So now, yeah, well, I'm gonna get this in, in a and probably race back out for another sesh. See how many we can get, see if we can get our limit. But um, yeah, no, probably dropping as many as we're getting in the boat as well. So there's some good numbers of fish around, which is pretty good and good quality too, so. Anyway, we were trying to hit that 60. We've come come close, we're scratching with, I think with 59. Jordan picked up a nice 59, so we've come close a couple other times, but no, nah, the 59's been the uh, been the one for us, but um, no, nah, I'm gonna keep going, picking them apart, the sinuous and get going.
on now. Oh, you're on now, though. <laughs> oh, maybe it wasn't a snag. <laughs> I thought I am snag. Flick it off. <laughs> and then I'm winding up slack. Oh, he's in the way, dog. I don't think I've put this much pressure on a yellow valley before. <laughs> Here's off the point again. Thought I was actually snagged, tried to flick it, do the line flick, get it off. And then I've gone to crack and it's just gone bang. Jeez, I just want to see it. I don't know if it's a cod, if it's a yellow, I have no idea. Side hook, she's so heavy. Oh no, big yellow, big yellow. Look how gold he is. Get this one out and give you guys a look. Lost two, now there's 56. Yes. What is nice and warm? Let's go. Let's go. You catch everyone. <laughs> I was like, what is it? I've got, a, I've got something. Lure on lure, like floats on float. Give us a look at that. Oh, he's lure, and then winds up another lure. <laughs> everyone thought it was about float on float, but it's usually yeah, lure on lure. It comes back! It's going straight in my basket. It's going straight in my basket. Yeah, I'm trying to take it. We're in the middle of a thunderstorm. <laughs> Cameraman balls over. <laughs> middle of a thunderstorm. Which we're about to get absolutely pissed on. And we've got people running home as oh yeah. We're running this bank that's getting absolutely pounded by waves. And we've got this lot this look. Look at this. <laughs> what an absolute stonker. <laughs> <laughs> this one's like gotta be like touching like. 58 at a stab. Still not bigger than the one before. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh. Look at this. Oh. Look at that. <laughs> Gotta get this uh, bad boy back. Do a little gimme tail on it. You! Gone! Well, we're in a bit of a bite window here. We're gonna get in as much, many casts as we can before we pull the pin and call it beer o'clock. <laughs> Let's go! Just what I was going off on the <laughs> last fish, thunderstorm, one last cast. Just back here behind me is actually where I pulled that fish. And then now we've gone no more than 10 meters and Jordan's pinned the fish. Another cracking fish. Oh, 
Oh you. Oh yeah. <laughs> Another one. Tom just got his like what? Couple minutes, four minutes ago. Five minutes ago, bro. Not yet. Not even two meters away. And we called it. We'll, we'll get one on this point. I said, nah. We'll get one before it. And it actually worked. Nice little 50, uh, 55 on the dot. Not good. Slobs. <sighs> Let's try to get another one. Boy, you're blessed.